Meantime, let's go live to Hannah Welker, who is in Gaston County, where the rivers are really starting to rise there. Hannah. Yeah, that's exactly what you're seeing right here, Ben. Behind me, this is the South Fork Catawba River. This is the same area which a few weeks ago, about a month ago, a group of kayakers actually got stuck here. And this is a similar situation. As waters rise because of heavy rain and flooding, the current becomes extremely fast. So I would advise if you plan to be on the river today, don't. The water is very high, which means it's dangerous and moving quickly. A lot of folks are saying flash flooding is happening in our area. With flooding comes standing water on the roads. If you're driving, don't risk it, guys. Don't try and drive through water because a foot of water could actually carry a car away. You don't know how deep it is until it's too deep and your car could be affected. You could be affected. One more reminder with this heavy saturated ground, Trees are also falling, so take a walk around your yard, check on your trees. If you have some dead ones, maybe call an arborist, call a tree company, and try to get those cut down because they are a big risk, especially in heavy rain like we're having right now. Guys, back to you. Hannah, some really good advice and some advice definitely to take seriously. And don't forget to keep up with WCNC. We have all the w latest weather alerts. And when we're not on the air, you can also visit us online. You check out the radars and the flood watch updates. Here's the thing. You're going to want to download the uh, WCNC app as well. You get all the weather alerts, and that's free to do so in your app store today. Six